Have you ever wondered how the dinosaurs went extinct or what could have caused the undoing to these colossal beasts? So have thousands of people and scientists, but unfortunately we have yet to come to a conclusion. However, there are many fascinating theories on the possibilities of their extinction. Probably the most well known is the asteroid theory. It was thought that about 65 million years ago, a sizable asteroid about 4 to 9 miles wide collided with the Earth. This collision would have caused fires, tidal waves, acute storms, and would have stirred thick clouds of dust into the atmosphere. This would have disabled the sun's light from reaching the planet for months. Between the cruel conditions and the fatal impact of the asteroid, there would be little to no chance of survival for the dinosaurs. Another possible theory is that there might have been a severe climate change. Scientists believe the Cretaceous period, or time of the dinosaurs, had a tropical climate due to the majority of tropical plants that grew then. It is thought that near the end of this time period, the temperatures harshly dropped. This was caused the plant life that grew to die and enable a chain reaction. The herbivores that fed on the plants would die out. The carnivores that consumed them would also perish. And the omnivores would have nothing to feed on either. This is another practical hypothesis and a common one. Other people believe many volcanic eruptions might have killed these species. When these volcanoes erupt, immense amounts of dust, sulfuric acid, an element that can cause burns when in contact with your skin, ash, and poisonous gases are released into the air. This would give little to no chance of breathing. In addition, lava would cover the ground and kill lots of plants, which is food for herbivores, and species of dinosaurs. All the dust and embers from the eruption was also changed the amount of sunlight and climate levels on the planet. Once again, this is a reasonable assumption with many believers attached to it. In addition, people consider that disease might have killed the dinosaurs. As the land began to dry up, it is proposed that animals use this opportunity to cross land bridges and enter new and unknown territory. When these animals did this, they were taking with them all the diseases that they had become immune to. But when they reached this new land and started to walk amongst the other creatures that had never encountered these diseases, they might have caused severe damage to the indigenous species. It would also work in the opposite way for the animals that carried over the disease when met with the new diseases from the other creatures could also perish. This is an equally important speculation. Although these are just a few theories, you can probably see that they could very well possibly tie into each other. What I mean by this is that if an asteroid were to collide with the Earth, dust and ash would rise into the air. The same would happen for many of volcanic eruptions. This would mean there would be no sunlight, and no sunlight would drop the climate on the planet. Also, disease could have been a huge contributing factor. What this makes me wonder is if all these theories are correct, and they all played a part in the dinosaur's extinction. But for now, all of our questions on the dinosaur's extinction will have to wait till a later date to be answered.